people often ask us what sets Achieve Fitness apart and we realize that it's so much less about what we do in the gym and so much more about how we make people feel. And what we realize is it's not that people aren't motivated. People go to the gym all the time. It's just that they haven't found the right place, the place that makes them feel comfortable, welcome, and confident in what they're doing. So we think that one of people's primary fears about going to the gym is that they just don't know exactly what to do. So they feel um, uncomfortable, they feel uh, intimidated. So instead of trying to experiment and figure things out or ask questions, they end up going to what's the easiest route, which is the treadmill or the elliptical. Um, by having a program, um, you have that level of certainty knowing that when you get to the gym, you know exactly what you're gonna do. And by having a coach there as well, you know that your form's gonna be on point and that you'll just be more motivated to come because you have that level of competency and that level of confidence. So personal training is one of those things that sound great in theory. It's one-on-one -on -one and the trainer tells you exactly what you should be doing. So exactly what exercise, what weight you should be using, how many times you should be doing it, and all those things. And it sounds great in theory, but the main problem with it is that it doesn't develop a concept of mindfulness and taking ownership of what you're doing. And it doesn't allow you to develop a sense of autonomy. You might meet with your trainer once or twice a week, but what happens the rest of the times during the week when you're on your own or working out on your own? And it's the main reason why we call our trainers coaches, because they help empower and educate people and help guide them along their way, as opposed to training them and telling them exactly what to do, which could then lead to a lack of independence when you're not with your trainer. And lastly, and probably most importantly, it's our sense of community. So we have people ranging from ages 16 to 65, and they're all very different, but they have the same common goal of becoming the best possible versions of themselves. And this understanding creates a sense of community and a sense of uh, support and empathy and a lack of competition or comparison. So when we have that sense of community, we can all come into the gym, say hello to each other, high five each other at the end, and really feel like we're a part of something. So any gym can have state-of-the-art equipment and personal training and amenities and spas. They can have all those things, but you won't be motivated to go if you don't have a sense of confidence in yourself when you get there, or a sense of autonomy when you go to the gym, or feel related to the community around you. So that's why we created the environment at Achieve Fitness, where you feel a sense of confidence, a sense of independence, and a sense of community.